How do I even start a review for that? Fuck me. Hey everyone, welcome back. Thank you very much for joining me on the channel today. Once again, of course, it's great to come back at you with a brand new video. Now today, it's gonna to be the second feature I believe we've done for this band. This particular video was done by my good friend over at Dark Spirit Photography. And I actually had both Dark Spirit and one of the guys from the band get in touch to get this one featured. Now it's Ryan Spencer that did message me on Instagram, who is the bass player for the band. We've been chatting a little bit over like the last couple of days. And he did actually tell me from the last video we did, it's actually popped up in conversations when people ask the boys what they sound like and they refer back to when I labeled them as filth core. So I think that's awesome that that's actually been getting discussed. That's crazy that, you know, especially when I'm all the way over here in UK and that they're there in Australia. But I'm looking forward to getting on this. So if you do dig the boys in sedative, please do be sure to follow them on all their socials. As always, I'll make sure it's all dropped down below. Big up to all the guys that do support on Patreon. If you'd like to jump over, just come over to support at patreon.com forward slash FYM Productions Media. Right, guys, I'm ready for this. I do think this is going to be somewhat of a crazy one. Crazy is always good, man. Let's get on it. This is Midnight Valentine by the boys over in Sedative. Let's go. Two and a half minutes. It's going to hit hard, isn't it? <laughs> Shit, man. How heavy is that bass? Man, that's crazy. The drop was literally still going. It's fun, man. This is serious shit. He went wrong, was he? Oh, oh. Right. Jesus, man. Rest in peace, speakers. He destroyed the symbol, no! Crazy bastards. Wow. All right, guys, so that was sedative and that was Midnight Valentine. Man, that song really does go hard. I uh, I mean, I do know, I am like aware of the boys sound previous, obviously, to doing this, but I don't think I was, I was quite ready for that. Definitely hits hard, man. Video as always, absolutely love this. I do love as well now how there's so many metal bands that aren't like, they don't have that look that they used to. You know, you don't necessarily need to have long hair and you can you wear what the hell you like. And I do love how it's sort of the sort of the new, like the old new metal look of like sportswear and stuff appears to be like back in. Certainly a lot of hardcore, metalcore. And of course, my filthcore boys over in Sedative. 
absolutely love this man this is really really cool it's one of these which isn't always my cup of tea but this particular one from these boys i mean this band in general really really is they sort of fit somewhere in between bands like i'd say no face no case and maybe deficit i would i think there's somewhere in between those two because they've got it where the riffs get slower you've got some dirty breakdowns in there i mean most of most of the song is practically almost a breakdown and then when you have them sick bass drops in like used to be a case of like right we'll stick a little bass drop in and then like it's like with these boys it's been like right let's drop on him but let's like leave it going for like at least 10 seconds and i love that man i do love that and the headphones that i have they real they are really powerful so when that bass drop comes to you it really does come to you really love this boys i think you've done a shit art release with this one as i said video from dark spirit you can never go wrong and um there's just nothing that i would change about it man I, th I think this is really sick you've got plenty of attitude and i love to see that in bands so carry on what you're doing i'll definitely be carrying on following you boys but you boys know you already got a fan in me man so it's all good now when it comes down to the lyrics with this one this one was quite an interesting one after looking through just shortly after the video i was just looking through the lyrics and i think the song essentially has to do with somewhat of a toxic relationship and wanting to be out of it but then again at the same time i think there's also a slight connotation of it being obviously within a toxic relationship something being quite abusive because one of the one of the lines in the song here goes she tells her friends i'm a dog as though she ain't the one who's been barking non-stop she says she tried to stop me from leaving well how the fuck am i the one that's left bleeding so that would be what leads me to think that obviously being the one that's left bleeding maybe it's like she's saying one thing but it's actually completely the other way around that could be the case if i'm wrong boys do do let me know i do always like to do my best to sort of interpret the lyrics as best as i possibly can but um that would be my interpretation on this one Big up to the band for reaching out once again and of course the Dark Spirit for reaching out at the same time. I was like, it's already, it's already going to be in the works, so it's all good. But guys, do let me know what you think. Get on their socials. Please do go on the original video, drop a comment. All massively helps for the algorithm so that these boys can get seen by so many more, which, which they 100% do deserve to be. But thanks for watching, guys. I'll see you all in the next one and I'll catch you next time. <coughs> Fuck says you're proud of